What is up guys, Jacob here, aka Jacob Juicer, and today we're back with another video. And today is episode, I think, six or seven, maybe five, I'm not sure, of my thoughts. My thoughts on coronavirus today. Um, coronavirus. So, coronavirus, if you do not know, which clearly you probably do know, um, it's this virus that has been going around that everybody is worried about. And so they're, like, closing everything down. Like, Italy, like, I'm pretty sure that they're kind of dense. Like, it's kind of like a small country with a lot of people. So Italy is on, like, lockdown right now. Like, no, like, getting in and out of the country. You can't leave your house without, like, government permission, which is really weird. Um, and the only things that are open are pharmacies and grocery stores. And some people say that... America, well, I, I live in America, that America's gonna do the same, which is really weird because there's only been 50 deaths in America and my school just closed down for a freaking month. So I thought that I might as well just make this video. I think that the media is kind of just like overreacting about it because it's basically the flu that just spreads easier. And like, if, if everybody knew how many deaths and how many like, people are getting the flu every year, then we'd be worried about that too, except flu's been around. And this is a new thing, so everybody's just like, holy crap, we don't know that much about it. So, boom. It's gonna kill everybody. Wow. <laughs> like, there's so many videos of, like, people that have gotten it, and they got over it, like, pretty quickly. And they're just like, yeah, it just went by, and yeah, I'm, I have a normal life now. <laughs> Like, it doesn't, it mostly only affects the, the older people with, like, bad immune systems, bad resp- Because it, it travels through respiratory, like, breath. That's why it's so easy to get. But, um, yeah, so if you have a bad immune system, a bad respiratory system, so it affects mostly older people or just, like, people with, like, asthma or, like, something like that. I think that's why- they're trying to get rid of how much it spreads because even though it is kind of like the flu, um, usually older people can get over the flu, but this is much like more like intense, I guess. Also, the thing with buying like 50 rolls of toilet paper every single day and hand sanitizer too. And the, the weird thing is Hand sanitizer doesn't even work against the virus because it doesn't have alcohol in it. You have to get a certain type of hand sanitizer that kills viruses. And normal hand sanitizer does not kill viruses. I suggest for getting um, information from is the CDC, the WHO, and a couple of doctor YouTubers. I watch a doctor YouTuber called Dr. Mike, and I suggest a doctor that actually like works at a doctor office because some People could be, like, acting like they're doctors, like, looking at fake stuff, thinking that they're so smart. Oh, yeah. I suggest Dr. Mike. He is a very... He's probably one of the most famous, um, like, doctors on YouTube. So, I suggest him, and he works at a doctor's office, and yeah. I'm just gonna call it COVID-19, because... Oh, yeah. They named it COVID-19. Now, CO for Corona, VI for Virus, D for Disease, and Dash-19, because it started in 2019. It just wasn't big back then. Um, oh, yeah. Also, it started from from people eating bats. <laughs> why would you eat a bat? I mean, it's just, why would you eat a bat? So, yeah, it did start off in animals. Um, sorry if I'm, if I'm getting off track here. I'm, I'm so much to cover. <laughs> like, like, there's 15 things that I could be, like, talking about right now. Also, there are just so many lies about it. I've heard from a couple of things, like, like, China was, like, doing, like, 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 they were testing out disease, well, like, virus bombs or whatever, like, basically bombs with, like, bad viruses in it to, to kill the U.S., and they were testing it on, like, a lake or something, and then the fish got infected, and then it's, I don't know, I keep hearing it, I keep hearing so many different things, like, there's, like 50 strings of it there's like two of them that are dangerous the two that are dangerous are spreading we're so unlucky blah 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 um i do kind of get that we are trying to stop it because 
I mean, it is bad. I'm pretty sure that we're going to get a vaccine in like 18 months, I think. 18 or 8 months. I'm pretty sure 18 months because Dr. Mike said that it was next year. I think that the death rate is 0.5% or 0.05%, something like that. Plus, this virus is so new, like, nobody really knows that much about it. There are also a couple of theories that, um, the reason why the media is overreacting about this is because they, they want Donald Trump, like, ruined. I, I don't know. Like, they want to put, like, all this responsibility on, like, Donald Trump's shoulders and he doesn't know what to do with it and stuff. And Donald Trump isn't really doing that much. But I kind of get why, because he doesn't want to start, like, a whole panic thing. Like, he doesn't want to be like, OMG, stay in your houses, blah, 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 which would cause even more panic. And, yeah, a lot of people are just freaking out. And, like, like, another thing, why close the school down for, like, a month? Like, I'm at my cousin's house right now. This is why it's, a, like, a different place. Um, But, like, why close the school down for a month? Like, imagine this whole thing just goes away in a week and we still have, like, we, we're we getting off, like, five weeks. Not even a month, like, even, like, a week more. But, um, like, why not go, like, week by week just to, like, be, like, more accurate? Because what if it goes away in, like, two weeks? And then you have three weeks of just no school for no reason. Like, what's what's what's, like, even the point of doing that? I mean, plus, also, we had school this last Friday, and we had a dance right after, and I usually look forward to the dances, a lot of people do, because, like, there's karaoke, obviously, hanging out with friends, fun, you know, getting food, like, all of that, and then they just cancelled it, like, a few days before, and here's the thing, if you're going to school the day before, then the same exact people are going to a dance. It's the same exact people. <laughs> so people would get the coronavirus or COVID-19 either way. Because if you're going to cancel the dance, then why not cancel the that day? Because it's the same exact people, the same exact sicknesses going around. Also, um, this whole coronavirus... COVID-19 thing is, is like making like the stock market like crash like a lot of people are going out of business like Disney World like freaking yeah Disney World they've been closed like well I think they're getting closed like this Sunday I think yeah Sunday and um they're getting closed and that's putting people out of jobs a lot of places like like I just got a notification excuse me, Taco Bell isn't letting people come there anymore. They either have to go to the drive-thru or get it delivered. So, like, all these places are putting people out of jobs. Oh, even the school, like, teachers, I don't know if they're getting paid or not. They pro they're they probably not because we're probably going to make up for it in the summer. But, um, yeah, it's putting, like, all these people out of jobs for a little bit. So, like... The stock market is just, like, my, my social study teacher even said, like, it's not the Great Depression. Obviously, it's not going to be that bad. Like, we're not going to be, like, have, like, no money at all for, like, 11 years straight. But it could, it could be kind of almost like that. Like, the economy is going to go down way a lot. And then a lot of people are, aren't going to have as much money because... Basically, like, all stockbrokers right now probably have, like, barely any money because, like, I mean, it is kind of good for them because if they sold just, like, a few weeks ago, like, three or four weeks ago, and then they waited a little bit, and then, because it's, it's basically, whenever the virus started, it was kind of like that, like, just barely going down because... In 2019, obviously everybody knows, like, December and January and early February, nobody cared about the virus. Like, they didn't even know it was a thing. Um, but in that mid to late J or February, it started to get, like,
pretty bad, so it's starting to do that. And then all of a sudden, boom, like everybody has it somehow because they're getting diagnosed and everything. And I think right now it's starting to slow down because just recently, it was like the best day in stock history. Like it went up like a bunch, but now it's back on the downward slope. And then I think right now it's kind of at like the almost middle point. Like here's the, here's the... Here's the bottom of the barrel, and then we're like here, we're just like about to go up, go back up. So if you, if you invested at that very, very lowest, or even like, like right here or right here, it's still going to go up at some point. So invest low, sell high, boom, stockbrokers are going to make so much money. Also, um, a lot of medical professionals have um don't have masks a lot of the mask businesses and um hand sanitizer businesses and pharmacy businesses a lot of them are gaining a lot of money so those stocks are going up but all the other ones are just <laughs> so um anyways if you're like a pretty healthy person, you're good. All that the COVID-19 does is from like like a three to two week span, you don't even know about it at first. So like, it could be like three days that you don't know about it or two weeks that you don't know about it. You don't know. But, um, and then I think that there's a couple of days that you have like, like a cold. And then I think one to two days is like flu-like systems sy symptoms or like a high fever like a 105 or something like that 106 so and then it just goes away and i'm kind of like in the middle like there's the people that don't care about it at all like oh it'll be fine like one week it'll just be gone like everybody will have it and then boom it'll be gone and then there's the people that worry about it <laughs> and then yeah, and then they're like, oh my god, <sighs> oh crap, I have coronavirus, I just coughed once, oh my god, I do not have a cold, I have the coronavirus, oh my god, and they're like worrying about it all the time, like I, 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 I think I was like having like some sort of an allergic reaction today, like my throat was kind of closing up a tiny bit, a little bit of coughs like it wasn't that big of a deal um i only passed out like four times it, it's okay <laughs> um but yeah and my dad and my uncle are just, were just like oh my gosh get away from me you have the coronavirus you're gonna get me killed you're gonna get killed oh my god <laughs> like chill out dude it's just like like, I just drank milk. It's probably milk. Like, I don't know. That's gonna be the end of the video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you smash that freaking like button down below. Let's see if we can get to three likes. I know that we can do it. We probably can't, though. That's, yeah, that's the problem. Probably can't. But let's get a one, one like. You, you got this. You got this. Come on. Let's, you got this. One person that watches my videos thanks mom and dad two people thanks bye